what's that, topaz? Yes, yellow is topaz. A topaz on one of the pillars. And this topaz looks to be almost identical in shape and everything to the emerald you found earlier. The only difference being the emerald was green. Is there any sort of indication of where I could place the emerald? I assume on one of these pedestals, but is there any indication where green might be more inclined to go in one location than another? Mm, I'm not just going to tell you that outright. Right. Yeah. What do I have to roll? Go ahead and roll an arcana for right now with what you've done. So I'm, I'm, You don't <clears throat> really have much of an idea. Yep, uh, I'm just going to not do anything with that then. Do, do, do these, uh, what, are these just like standard barrels, sort of just random? Car? Yeah, it's just like random miscellaneous. It's more like scrap metal than anything else. Nothing particularly uh, useful. There is the one crate that looked like it was like nice, expensive, that I was storing something other than scrap, but it is currently uh, empty. Completely empty, okay. Shiki? Uh, yeah. like, uh, I'll just, I'm just going to have a quick investigation of the interior, just to make sure it's not anything, you know, like it's a trap door or anything disguised. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't appear to be a trap door or anything. Like, you can see that there is the outline, like some dust of something that used to be in there at one point, but was taken out. It looks to be roughly shaped as though it was ingots of metal. Hmm. So I'll step into this room. I could probably I'll use your help here. Yes, uh, I live in quarter. Yeah, fine. I'll put you to see what Jade wants. Right. Yes. I believe this is where we should place the emerald. Although, I have a feeling if I place it in the wrong spot, chaos may ensue. <sighs> uh, okay, so anything mechanical looking, or does it just look like pedestals? It doesn't look anything particularly mechanical in this room, no, but you can tell kind of, based on what you saw of the golem, that this red gem in the center, it had a perfect slot to fit into that golem. Hmm. Um, I'm gonna... If I was gonna investigate what these gems might be... Um... <clears throat> any... What check would that be? One second. Felia, what stupid thing are you doing? <laughs> I was sitting here thinking about what I was going to do. I'm not going to say it yet. Um, <laughs> by the way, I'm going to... We're taking a long rest, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm going to heal myself and shake you with my last two cure wounds. Cheers. Before sure. something terrible happens. Alright. So you could roll an arcana to help figure this out. Okay. <laughs> this one's on Shiki. Fifteen. All right, you get the feeling that it's obviously some sort of, like, these gems are meant to power whatever the red one is in the center, and it's meant to draw power from all four. Hmm. Um, Jay, just place the emerald on the one next to me. Okay. Uh, Jade will place all the right. emerald on the one next to Shiki. Shiki, you gain 18 HP, by the way. <sighs> all right, perfect. All right. Shiki, roll me a deck save. Uh, give me a sec. I'm gonna switch over to my tablet for chat. Okay, just mute. I want to stay muted. Okay. But if I need to speak, I can at least. Okay. Uh, nice you. Sorry, deck safe. Yep, deck safe. Give me a sec. Don't call it just. I'm good. <laughs> yeah. Do I have to roll anything? Oh no. Shiki, as the gem is placed there, and you are standing between the two, you are buffeted from both sides, taking 16 lightning damage, and nine bludgeoning damage, and the Dear. emerald just pops right back out. Well, that seems to have not worked. Let's try another I, one. I grab the emerald and I place it in this one. You place the emerald in this one. Uh, let me put it centered. You place the emerald in that one, and yes, I had the emerald handy. <laughs> and the same effect goes on, though this like bludgeoning effect in the lightning courses between the two, and it flows into the red gem. Ow. Does it explode? No. Oh. Does it look like it's powering up? It appears that it's drawing the energy out of this stream. Right. In that case, while they're doing that, I'm going to actually investigate this chest that oh, that was up here. All right. Shiki, you open up the chest and roll me. I'm just kidding. It's not trapped. <laughs> <laughs> you open up the chest and inside you see that there is one particular thing of note. It appears to be a rolled up scroll. Uh... Can I... I'll, I'll look into it. 
Yeah, you take the scroll out and you open it up, and these appear to be blueprints. Very interesting blueprints. As huh. you, I'm assuming you're going to take them over to the desk and yeah. pull them out fully so you can read them. As you look them over more and more, you realize these blueprints are for the apparatus. More interesting, though, you know that based on what like, the time you've spent with the apparatus and various things you've done here and there, that the blueprints that these are meant to do are vastly superior to what it actually is. Hey, hey, dummies, have a look at the, come here and have a look at this. At the call of her name, Dummy, Jade will obligingly enter. <laughs> Clytus will also enter as well because he's heard something interesting, apparently. This looks like our crab tank. Yeah, but I, it doesn't have <clears throat> these functions. Perhaps Give me you one can... moment. Like, roll... Yeah, for me, roll a intelligence tinkering check. Perhaps with these blueprints, you may be able to apply some of these apply. applications to our tank. Like, I'm just going to try to see exactly how much she can tell from what it is to what it actually well, is. Like, she can tell immediately that it is more, but I'm trying to see how much more. 28. 3,000. All right, so she rolled a 28, so a very good thing. So things that she can tell right now is, first of all, its structure is a lot better. It's able, like, it has more armor. Like, it'd be harder to damage. It can go, it can take a lot stronger pressure. And most important, most interestingly, the control system is a lot, like, much more enhanced versus the 10 lever setup it has currently. So we wouldn't have to spend a turn to do every lever, basically. Effectively... And meta terms, she believes it would turn more into a mount compared to what it is currently. <clears throat> so, like, you would move and then attack, like, do two attacks and stuff like that. It would be more like a mount than you pull a lever to move, you pull a lever to do one attack. Crap. Um, that sounds I I, useful. I might have to just take these because um, I don't think I'm going to be able to copy these down in time. Well, he's not here. You would not be able to copy them down in time. It would. <laughs> to properly copy every detail he has on this, it would take you probably two, three days. Um, okay. Um, I, I, I get a bit, bit of paper. I write down, <laughs> write down in it. Um, take, taking your designs for a better purpose. Sorry about that. Love, future's cheeky. <laughs> so I think we've I like, figured out what stupid thing Feely is gonna do we've, now. We've... Oh, for God's sake! <laughs> She's gonna see what happens if she removes the red gem. All right. So you go to touch the red gem. All right. I use a two by four to kind of just push it off. All right. So you because push the I'm red gem out of the way, to... and it falls to the floor, completely fine. Oh. You go over and you pick it up though, and it feels like it has this slight glow to it, but the glow is fading very quickly. I'm, I'm gonna. Well, I'm here and now. I'm gonna put my love letter in my love note in back into the chest where we found I the. I quickly uh, hide the gem in my pa uh, pouch. In your pants. Okay. <laughs> in your hair. Once, uh, obviously. once Shiki leaves the room, Jade's going to open up the chest quietly and just write overthinking on the bottom of the page and then put it back in. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I love that joke. It's so stupid. So, so, much, so much sabotage. Uh, Filio, what are you doing? Nothing. Uh, I, I clearly see the red gems gone. Don't I? Don't do anything. You can see that the red gem is clearly gone, so long as Philia is not standing in the way. Jade. What? But if Philia is standing in the way to kind of block the view, it's very obviously that she did something. Fluffy was messing around, <laughs> messing around. The red gem's gone. Let me know when something new comes up. Uh, has she? <laughs> has Shiki really spent a lot of time investigating these these chests? Is there she anything? She spent a bit of time investigating them thereabouts. Um, Yep. She found, like, there's a bunch of scrap metal, and there's one chest that's empty, and it appears based on the dust that it may have held metal ingots before. Is there uh, anything here that might be able to be converted into useful things, like bullets or armor or anything like that? Bullets would be the most likely thing. Like, for the most part, it's all scrap metal, and it would take time to actually convert it. Could I take a sampling and put it in our bag? Sure, you could take a bit of scrap metal. Alright. Uh, Pity I put the gem back. Why do you think I have it? Because I don't trust you. Clytus comes up because I don't have it. 
Did you even have it to begin with? No. Yeah. Yeah, I, uh, I kind of missed the meaning of that one. Anyway, put the. I I know you've got the gem. Put it back. I put it on this pedestal. All right, Lilia. Just gonna back up. Roll me a <laughs> That was the stupid thing, just so you know. <laughs> Alright, you barely fail this deck save, and you will take... 48 damage. 6 lightning damage as the topaz behind you just surges through you towards the red gem. No bludgeoning, huh? That's nice. No bludgeoning. Yeah, because the bludgeoning came from the green gem. Oh. Jade's going to pick up the red gem. And the trails both stop moving. She's going to place it back where it was carefully. And the trails once again shoot through it, going directly through diagonally, so like that. And she's going to step away. And this is why we don't touch the magical gems. Please don't make me trap this room. <laughs> you, you, you guys just trigger all this stuff on your own. <laughs> it's not even an official trap, but you just keep doing it. <laughs> pity, pity. Let's, let's, that's it. Everyone out. Everyone out right now. By the way, uh, Philia, if you if you did a good enough insight, you could tell that she's bluffing because I'm completely out of spells right now. <laughs> All right. Um, Clyde is like we should probably just take a rest then, yeah, so we, we can should, be ready for Blackmore before the time goes on. Maybe we should ask the lion lady if she knows where he is. Uh, I'm, uh, before I go out, I'm just gonna, because you said there was loads of papers, there's nothing interesting for these pa in these papers. The only thing that was fairly interesting would have been the uh, diagram notes for the uh, golem. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's uh, nothing particularly fancy that, like, that you haven't already figured out. It, the only thing of note is that you see that there is that red gem not in it at the moment, but like next to it. Hmm. Any, anything written about any other gems? Um, you can see in the gems as well that there is, with that red gem like down the corner, around it at four points you see a symbol, you see four symbols. One representing air, one representing earth, one representing fire, and one representing water. Huh. Air and earth are opposite, fire and water are opposite. Makes sense. So, sapphire... What is and this? Is that... That appears to be a mannequin. Okay, cool. So, it, it's a mechanical mannequin, actually, and it's half completed. Can I okay, kind so, of drag it over to uh, this other room? I I would if I could move it. <laughs> oh, um, it's on the map. Does it does it appear to have a slot in it like the other golem did for a power no, source? No, it is even it not at all. It is even less completed than anything else you've seen in this room. It, like it's roughly humanoid in shape and size. Uh, um, that, I, many parts of it are missing. It basically just has the frame superstructure. Can I look at it? Do does I do I get anything from it? Uh, you may do a intelligence tinkering okay. or oh, yeah. intelligence. Okay. Yeah, yeah, tinkering. Yep, 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 yep. Twenty. All right. This it looks at your first glance to be an appearance, a uh, attempt to like make like what the golem outside is on a smaller scale. Though, based on what you can see of it, it looks as though it's been reconfigured a few times, as though it's not the first attempt at this. Mm, like, you can see, like, parts of it look like they were connected in different places, as though it's been rearranged. You probably smashed, smashed the others. You say that, like, you think, like, there are others. Hmm. Right then. So, okay. Maybe a prototype. I'm done in here for the moment, so... Come on, come on, everyone, out the room. Maybe Especially... we should sleep here. There is a bed. Yeah, but there's only one bed. We can share. Yeah, I'm sleeping out. <laughs> be quite honest, I think most of you would uh, stab me if I shared with you. I'll sleep out here. I uh, Minus just jumps I, down. I don't, I don't stab. I tend to just leave massive holes in people. Well, especially, stabbing can leave a hole in a person. Yeah, yeah, especially through the heart. And you're too... Um, Sphinx! 
Hmm. Yes? Would you happen to know where Blackmore is? She'll point off to this direction. Actually, she'll point up when you ask about where Blackmore is. So top of the tower? He may be at the top. I believe that's where he is at this time. Well, we should probably get this long rest out of the way and hurry. We should probably hurry up and take this eight hours. <laughs> Stupid needing long rest. <clears throat> Is there any other information you think would be useful for us to know? Hmm. Hmm. Like hmm. certain gemstones? It might be best for you to recover what was stolen by the those accompanying Blackmore, but other than that, nothing comes to mind. He didn't take any of my books, after all. Jade's going to climb down the ladder so she doesn't take any more damage and go up to her... Can you identify these potions? She will look at them for a second. Hmm. I could, if you were willing to answer a riddle. I mean, I'm willing to answer anything. Hmm. What would be the perfect riddle to ask in this case? Oh, let me think. 24. How about this? Unwelcome and difficult. Precious and rare. What am I? Time. Incorrect. You didn't say I needed a correct answer. You just said I needed to answer. Also incorrect. <laughs> Does anyone else care to take a guess? You have one left. Repeat the question. Unwelcome and difficult. Precious and rare. What am I? Life. That was my first guess, but I don't think that's right. None of you got it? The truth. Huh. That's, that's it, I'm going to bed. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> I suppose most of the rest of our answers also make sense. Mm. It's the problem with riddles. Time is not that unwelcome or difficult. It's worth something more as free time or liberated time, but that is a beside the point. And true love is rarely unwelcome. <laughs> you would be surprised. <laughs> Alright, so taking a long rest. Sleep, 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 sleep. So she's, she, right. she just asked us to answer a riddle. She didn't ask us to answer it correctly. Don't be a smart ass and go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> would you like to try again with perhaps more of a dangerous cost to it? What kind of dangerous cost? Bedding. If you answer incorrectly, I take the potions and keep them myself. No. <laughs> that sounds fun. What about we try these one potion at a time? I, I at this point, oh, at this point, I fire a, a shot between her, <laughs> between Jade's feet. No. Go to bed. Jade's still holding the potions out and looking at the Sphinx. Doesn't even flinch at the shot. The, the next one hits your butt. <laughs> oh! Let her play one more time. For one so, potion. Round and round it goes. For one it's potion, awesome. yes. How about... She's gonna pull out the childlike potion. How about this it's one? How, it's, how gambling, it's how gambling works. They pull you in and they get everything. <laughs> <laughs> I have... let's see... Still three times to answer, right? You idiot! No, only once this time. Once You've this been time. Full. Okay. Soft as velvet, can't be touched. Hides the world, but isn't much. Now, before I answer, I would like to confer with my friends. Soft as velvet, can't be touched. 
hides the world. It sounds like clouds, but I'm not sure sounds, if that's the case. Sounds like, sounds like clouds, but that would, might be pretty obvious. Sorry, I'm shouting. I'm pretty far away from you guys. Why don't you get closer, Shiki? No, I like sleeping up here. <coughs> I'm already in my sleep. I'm already. She's already in the sleeping bag. <laughs> we will say clouds. Hmm. You know, it is a wondrous thing when you already know the correct answer to a question. It's quite nice when you get a different answer that isn't wrong. Hmm. The answer I was seeking was either darkness or night, but <laughs> clouds does fulfill everything I described. So does this count as correct? Yes, and she will hold her hand over the potion and uh, like mutter a spell. You identify that she, or you can tell that she is actually casting identify. <laughs> this is this is this is more, this is worse than the time that I had that riddle game. The guy said an egg was a box. <laughs> <laughs> an egg was a worm. All right, so this potion, as she identifies, she kind of nods at herself. This is a potion of longevity. When you drink this potion, it appears that your physical age will be reduced to a minimum. Though, it seems if you drink it too much, it would instead age you. Like Ashtel. You get years back, or your physical age is reduced, though your mentally would stay as old as you are. We should probably have. We should probably keep hold of that one. So That's interesting. Nobles. <clears throat> I am willing to try one more. What do you guys think? Feel free to sleep, Shiki. <laughs> I words, I can, but you keep me up with riddles. <laughs> you want to try once more? Sure. What I potion would you like to try next? The Crimson Heartbeat Potion. The Crimson Heartbeat Potion. Now let's see. Always smiles or maybe frowns. Sinks in water, never drowns. Catches prey on its barbed teeth. Hunts all day, but never eats. She's up there, we'll see. <clears throat> can you type or copy paste that one in? I cannot copy paste, but I can type it. Give me All a moment. That is one that I am. Can I roll a nature check? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not nature. I'm pretty sure. Uh, man. I am super good at riddles, just so you know. This is, this is totally my thing. Always smiles, maybe frowns. Sinks in water, never drowns. Anyone? Thinking, anyone have ideas? I'm, think, I'm thinking wave. You're thinking wait? Waves. Waves. Because they can. Because uh, you can. It can be a smile, a smile or frown, kind of like a mouth motion. Uh, it, it could be. It could be curved. Doesn't really sink in water. Uh, I was thinking a net. Hmm. That is a net. Smile and frown. Nets don't it have barbed like... teeth. Some nets do actually. They have barbs on them. I I think it would be something slightly more. Um. Not specifically hunting. You got us remember. You got us. Yeah, but and it says all day, so it's something that's probably constantly happening. Do you have an answer? You're uh, gonna lose it. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> I would suggest you hurry up. If you take too long, well... I think... I Well, Blackmore wins anyway, but I think you have all the time in the world. Yes. Are you just gonna have Yasana say that outright as though it's the answer? That's the wrong answer, but always smiles, maybe frowns, sinks in water, never drowns. Sinks in water, waves sink in water. They don't really. The Sphinx will nod at Yasana. That is correct. Huh. And she begins to cast the identification on the uh, Crimson Heart Potion. 
fish hooks do not hunt all day. How long do people fish? Several hours. Virtually all day. Daytime. Day. It never eats what it catches, and it's always catching prey on barbed. Fish hooks are barbed. God damn it. I'm gonna sleep. Alright, so this potion was this one, I believe? Beating heart? Yes, crimson beating heart. <clears throat> this potion is... Potion I'm of vitality. back, boys. Yeah, this potion is a potion of vitality. It will remove any exhaustion you suffer and cure a disease or poison affecting you, and for about a day, you will heal very well any time you rest. You regain maximum number of hit points for any hit die you spend for 24 hours. All right. Well, I think it might be time for that rest. What? Don't want to play another? I'm running out of riddles. <laughs> <laughs> I'm running out of riddles. I don't think you guys will get instantly. Let me put it that way. I'm trying to pick riddles that you guys don't get instantly. It's fine. We've got half an hour to answer one more riddle. It's fine, guys. <laughs> we can do this. I was hoping the chat would help me with the riddles, but they're like, uh... <laughs> Come on, chat! <laughs> I can't cheat any other way than you guys. <laughs> uh, all right. <laughs> I have like eight Discord groups I can cheat with. Like, no. I'm amazed you didn't get that because those freaking riddles are all from the whatever the Sphinx is in Tome of Beast. It has the page with eleven riddles. I haven't read it though. Like I don't memorize those riddles. I think you didn't. I didn't, had a feeling you didn't memorize, but I had a feeling like it might have been like a thing. Like you glanced over, it, saw, it, and like hearing the riddle may have jogged your memory towards it. <laughs> uh, I may have seen some of them, but I don't remember them at this point. What yeah. I will do, however, is just I'm just gonna walk over, grab a book, a book shape, walk okay. back, and be like. Can you translate this? I could, <laughs> though I do not know why you'd want to read about the dietary and bathroom needs of the hobgoblins. Your son has some interesting God hobbies. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to find a book she is interested in, but can't read. Here, Yasana. I'll I'll help translate one for you. Uh